Welcome back to Dream Does Gaming. Dream Deer playing some more Gemfire today. Uh, finished. Play another round of Gemfire. I'm debating between Tarion's War and starting as Gwen, or Gemfire and starting as Lorne. I think I'm going to go with that one. So scenario four, the Lankshire family bribe Pender to desert his own brother Aaron. They hope to ally with Edric, long lost son of Ezrold, and gain his land in the south. One ruler will have to stop the warring and reunite Gemfire. Um, this one's going to be a lot harder with the Blanche fam family. Aaron um, has starts off with two wizards, Zendor and Skalric. Lyle has Polvius and Chyla. The Tidoria family actually has Empiron. Uh, they're fun to play too. I don't mind them at all. And then the Divas family. Actually, they don't start with anything. So, should be fun. He has a high war stat though. Um, actually, the second highest starting one in the game, I believe. Uh, that, that you can start with. I mean, Pender and Elgis, I believe, are higher, but... Yeah, we'll go into that. Edric and Ashland is rumored to be Ezreal's lost son. That rumor is a sign that we have new rivals in the south, but our greatest rival, the king, is weakening. Uh, yeah, well, you know what? Doesn't really matter, I never use the advisor. Let's go with Eldro today. I have the wisdom to guide you in your quest for peace. Alright. One of the first things we kind of need to do here. One, see what kind of monsters there are. Ogres and skeletons. Skeletons aren't so bad. They're super cheap. And they're better than absolutely nothing. Everyone's going to be expanding. We don't want to worry about that right now. Skeletons as well. Yeah, sure, we'll take those. Then the next biggest thing that we really want to worry about, at least in this first year, is getting those good events. There he went on a rampage, of course. Uh, so we're going to be developing a lot in this first little bit here. Actually, we should see. Ooh. Sell half our food, actually. Just get those troops up, those troop numbers up a little bit here. The Aaron and Ander fight it out. Um, really, one of the biggest things that we're going to want to do is probably go south first. Plague hit us, of course. At least an earthquake can't. Alright, do we still have... Okay. Just selling half. We're also going to recruit just a few more troops here. And then we're going to be doing a lot of cultivating a lot of protection. We need to get those good events here, so that's really the biggest thing. We are kind of in a bad area, too, so... Cool. 
believe if you do three of these in a row, then you get a good event. So, and one of the things that we really want to try and get to are passes. We get passes to join our team here. I'll feel a lot better. Ooh, flag hitting the ones that are around us. It's fantastic. The flood hitting us. Not fantastic. Wow, that really decimated us. Take a quick view down here. Oh, that's Pender. Interesting. Uh, Roland. Jerris. At least these guys have, like, nothing. King has rolled. Alright. Protection up some more there. I don't like it being so low, but it's not exactly going very high for us. Alright. back into the 30s. And one of the other big things that we're going to want to do as well here um, is try and get Pender to join us. If we can have him defect, that's going to be great. Yeah, there we go. Charm. That's exactly what we wanted to see. Because right now, if we can do this, oh, not change, Lord, defect to Pender. Yes, there we go. That's exactly what we want. Right in August, right when they're about to get a nice big crop. The only bad thing, he has a tendency to keep on switching. Good. Hit the people that need to be hit for a... No fires. That's fantastic. Prices are low. That's fine. Build up your protection and everything right now. Actually got a decent amount. Now, do you have any monsters? Ulahais? Definitely not my favorite. I guess I'll keep them though for now. Take a quick view down here. You have a lot of stuff. So does Ezrold. Can we plunder from Ezrold? Nice. Just continue getting those events. Let the wars happen down here. That is completely fine by me. Let's see if we can invade nine or er, nineteen to twenty, and then nineteen out to twenty-two. Feel a lot safer here. But this first year is not really about invading. It's about building. Getting your uh, baselines up. Yeah. Defected to the Doria family. He said, he does that. He's kind of a jerk. Oh, and they uncovered our plot with that, too. That's actually quite surprising. Sell off most of our food. Recruit most. There we go.
could hit everyone around us. <laughs> nice. The more things that happen that aren't towards us, the better. Oh, darn. Alright. There you go. Get a big army now. Deter people from wanting to attack us. just continue developing at the moment. I'm probably gonna go up oh man and do a couple years in each one in each episode. Mostly because there's not gonna be a lot of fighting to begin with. send some supply there you go nice rounded up some troops news are finally in the 40s for you everything into the 60s nice continuing to hit all those for us Plunder some people. Ezreld, a little bit from you, sir. Lord Roland, Jerris, or Pender. At least his army isn't the strongest. Nice. There we go. Should look. I don't really have a lot there. In fact, no one really does. Wow. Interesting. Let's kind of continue to plunder people a little bit. If they're doing it to us, we should do it to them. Nice. Give away a lot of food here. Get that loyalty up. 
get that production even higher. chunk of change for you guys. Here people, eat our bread. <sighs> nice. Still super low at the moment. That's okay. Because now, it's a good time to do some plundering for a turn or two. Oh yeah. Fantastic. That food supply. do it for two turns and then we'll head back to building up the armories yeah see once you're able to plunder from no that's not good shadow of doom all right yeah there we go sell off most of the food recruit most There we go. Now when we're looking at like that kind of army in 800s, we're looking pretty good because when we attack, we can send in half the army. We don't have to send in a full army. But we're gonna have a huge troop advantage. It's gonna help us when we have to fight things like wizards, dragons, etc. How's he looking for food? Still pretty good. You're not, so I would love to try and plunder him out. Get as much of their food as we can. While you are just gonna continue getting the good stuff. Everything's almost in the 40s. That's nice. The 50s is a good spot. Get everything back up into the 60s for you. Nice, calm, stormy winds. Very good. I should say. I really wish um, 
these guys would be fighting a lot more. Not really a lot of that today. It makes it hard to do much. Unicorns, good. It is what we like to see. Everything into the 70s, that'd be nice too. Good. Develop. Protection. Wow. All of our food. Is gone. <laughs> All right. Not liking that. We lost a lot of troops too. Let's try and get some of that back. Can you plunder from him? Yes. Good. some good tax in. Alright. Buying most of that food again. Way 50. Surprise that actually hit us. That's not good. Hmm. Especially that one. That's not that's really not a good one for it to hit. Can you get Pender to defect again? No. Alright. Thought I would try. I really want to take 19 over. That's the biggest thing. Yeah, that play really hurt. Alright. We're going to go into a month of attacking here. We're just going to send half. Use our skeletons. more than five days of food. Yeah, they are going to be using their wizards. We do have to do this. Um, a little bit differently than we normally would. So that wizard's going to be hard for us to deal with. With just skeletons. But, I mean, if they just want to break all their fences, that's also fine. Sometimes, uh, the computer is weird like that. That's going to be less good now, actually. Probably shouldn't have fenced there. 
Sai. Because if I go here, he's just gonna run. Yeah, we'll catch him. That's okay. I'd rather flank him before he frontals me. There we go. Good hit in there. Yeah, leave that flag open, that's fine. up there. Perfect. That's exactly what we like to see. Take out these guys. Good. better, actually, when they do that. Nice. Rear assault their archers here. That's going to be great for us. There we go. go. Hit their wizard. Skeletons can come up here and hit theirs. There you go. Skeletons I'm really less concerned about anything else. Good job. Fence yourself in. Yeah, they're going to be a while up there trying to break my fence, so that's fine. <laughs> and we're going to be a while trying to break their fence, so that's also fine, I guess. Killed off the archers. Let's continue doing these flanking shots against their wizard. And get a rear assault against the wizard too. We'll take that too. Didn't quite work for us, that's okay. It sucks now that we have the uh, the gap in between here, but the wizard's gonna go for our fence, so. Let's 
so that's okay. Just by my standards. Here we go. The wizard's gonna be no more very soon. Now they're going to try retreating. Yeah, that's fine. I'm okay with this. The skeletons were kind of put there as a sacrifice, so... It didn't really matter too much anyways. on those fence breaks. Alright, well, at least you're breaking fences. So that's good. The wizard's almost dead, which is also good, almost good. There we go. Retreated. Here's the bigger thing here, attack him on the flank, there you go. Still can't break it. Wow. It's quite surprising. Yeah. One flank attack in, that's okay. Also because that's also fine by me. Do this. Rear attack there, guy. Flank him there. Should get the kill. Didn't quite get the kill. That's sad. Oh well. Start doing some damage to this guy now, though. 18. I'll take 18 damage. Wow. <laughs> We're, uh, not doing so well with this. Alright, come down. Take him out. Of 
perfect. And continue to not break fences. Good. There you go. Skeletons know what to do. The archers still have to go twice more to kill this guy. They've retreated. Alright then. We've captured him. Whew, gold or food? Uh, gold didn't really matter to me. I think they would have paid out gold more than they probably would have paid out food. So, there's that. Awesome. Good. Finally, we got in a battle. Year three. But it's a good thing that we do these. Um. We're gonna buy, actually, half the food there. We're gonna give away a whole bunch of it, but in a moment change lord here at 17 to a vassal that we have either Elias or Melgan probably Elias there we go we're gonna give away a bunch of food here to the people coming into a territory where it's uh, pretty high up there so that's super good for you. You plunder the king a little bit. No. That would have been nice. Of course, the Shadow of Doom. But you get some free troops. Like free troops. There we go, we've expanded our kingdom by half its size. So that's good. Uh, just continuing to build up now. Average prices. I mean, that's the bad thing about, um, ah, yeah, I'm not getting an ogre. They rampage way too much. The, the nice thing about, um, or the hard thing about being Lauren or Gwen even is you have to use your size advantage in troops rather than uh, rather than getting your uh, numbers up or uh, like monsters and things like that but that's gonna be it for this episode now we actually got a fight in there three years took us a little bit of time so I hope you're enjoying this one uh, oh nice got a charm that's always good for us. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks again. Bye-bye.